हेलो वेलकम डी स्टूडेंट्स इस वीडियो में हम क्रेमर्स रूल डिटर्मिनेंट का क्रेमर्स रूल ओके दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सी एक्सरसाइज 4.3 पॉइंट थ्री इज देर ऑन क्रेमर्स रूल तो प्रीवियस वीडियो में हमने फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन अटैम्प्ट किया था सो विल कंटिन्यू विद द सेकेंड क्वेश्चन और इज इज सेकेंड क्वेश्चन इट इज इज सेकेंड क्वेश्चन यू हैव टू सॉल्व दिस बाय यूजिंग क्रेमर्स रूल So what are the equations? X plus y minus 2z equals to 10. 2x plus y minus 3z equals to minus 99. 4x plus 6y plus z equals to what? 2. So I say three equations. So you have to solve these three equations by uh, Cramer's rule. So Cramer's rule is what? X is equal to dx upon d. Y is equal to dy upon d. dy वाई अपॉन डी एंड जेड इज इक्वल टू क्या है डी जेड अपॉन डी सो वट आर दिस डी डी एक्स डी वाई एंड डी जेड सो डी इज वॉट डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ द कोफिशियंट्स ऑफ एक्स वाई जेड एंड डी एक्स इज ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम डी बाय रिप्लेसिंग कोफिशियंट्स ऑफ एक्स बाय कॉन्स्टेंट्स डी वाई इज ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम डी बाय रिप्लेसिंग कोफिशियंट्स ऑफ वाई बाय कॉन्स्टेंट्स और उसमें जेड बाय कॉन्स्टेंट्स कोफिशेंट्स ऑफ जेड बाय कॉन्स्टेंट्स सो लेट्स फाइंड डी डी इज वॉट ये स्टूडेंट्स डी इज वॉट इट इज डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ सी एफ डी इज डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ द कोफिशेंट्स ऑफ एक्स वाई जेड वन वन माइनस टू इट इज टू वन माइनस थ्री एंड फोर Six one. So expand it. One into uh, one plus eighteen. That is nineteen minus one into uh, two plus twelve. That is fourteen plus minus two into minus two into this minus two into two into six twelve minus four. Okay, it is twelve minus four. It is eight. So this will be nineteen minus fourteen minus sixteen. So this is minus thirty and nineteen. So it gives us minus eleven. So t is equal to what? Minus eleven. So yes, students, so you are getting t is equal to what? Minus eleven. So here we are getting d is equal to minus eleven. Then now we find d x. So let's find d x. So in d x, what we do? Uh, d x is obtained from d by replacing coefficients of x by constant. So these coefficients we replace by what constant terms. So what are the constant terms? Minus ten, minus nineteen, and two are the constant terms. Constant numbers. Uh, right hand side minus ten, minus nineteen, and two are the constants. So one one six, minus two minus three. And one expand this determinant minus ten. See the expansion one plus eighteen. Then minus one into minus nineteen minus nineteen plus six plus minus two into minus two into what minus. <coughs> 19 into 6, okay, and minus 2. So it is minus of 114 minus 2 minus 2. This minus 2. Then we solve it. 
this is what 19 so it is 119 this is what minus 13 minus 13 and this plus 13 it will be plus 13 here it is how much it is 116 and it will be plus now 116 okay 21 uh, 231 so this is 116 and multiplied by 2 so we find it which is <coughs> 245 okay it is 245 245 minus 190 this gives us okay this gives us <coughs> 55 Okay, so it is 55. <coughs> then we obtain, uh, we find what? dy. Yes, students, dy we will find. So, how we get dy? It is obtained from d. dy is obtained from d by replacing the coefficients of y by constants. 1, 2, 4. So this coefficients of y we replace by this coefficients of y we replace by constants. One to four is first column as it is. Second column me likna hai apko minus ten, minus nineteen, or two. And the third column as it is. And the third column as it is minus two, minus three, one. So expand this determinant. We'll expand this determinant. The expansion of this kya hoga? So what will be the expansion? 1 into minus 19 plus 6 minus of minus 10 into 2 plus 12. Okay, 2 plus 12, then minus 2 into 4 okay it is 4 and minus of minus okay 76 then so we find this value it is equal to what minus 13 yoga uh, it is <coughs> 14 so this will be 140 and this is what 80 so it is 16 okay 80 into uh, minus 2 this then uh, find out this value it is minus 13 and it will be minus 20 so this gives us minus 33 okay so minus 33 hai. dx you are getting 55 minus 33 and dz we will find out dz yes students dz so how to get dz dz is obtained from b here 1 2 4 second column is 1 1 6 or third column matlab z ke coefficients we will replace by minus 10 minus 19 constants that is 2 expand this determinant so what will be the expansion of this 1 into ok students 1 into uh, 2 plus <coughs> see here it is 2 minus of minus to be plus 1 1 4 okay 2 and minus of minus it is 1 1 4 19 to 6 
minus 1 into 4 ok it is 4 plus minus of minus it is plus 76 and minus of 10 into minus 10 into minus 10 into uh, 12 minus 4 it is yes. so how much it is this is 116 this is 80 this is what 80 and uh, this is what 8 minus 80 it is minus 80 so this gives us 116 minus 160 so that will be minus of that will be minus of 44 ok yes minus of 44 uh, minus of 44 we are getting so thus you are getting d is equal to what yes students d is equal to what minus 11 what is dx dx is equal to 55 yes 55 what is dy dy is equal to minus 30 and what is dz so we are getting dz is equal to minus 44 so all these are multiples of 11 now you are getting d dx dy and dz after that x is equal to what x is equal to kya hai dx upon d by Kramer's rule so it is 55 upon minus 11 which is minus 5 y y is equal to what dy upon d that is what is our dy dy is minus 33 upon minus 11 which is plus 3 and z is equal to what dz upon d what is our dz so dz is minus 44 upon minus 11 which is 4 so we are getting x is equal to what x is equal to listen here we are getting x is equal to yes x is equal to we are getting minus 5 y is equal to 3 and z is equal to what 4 so let us check these values will satisfy the equation or not so this values satisfy the equation or not so yes students we are getting here x is equal to minus 5 y is equal to 3 and z is equal to 4 z is equal to a 4 so let us check this will satisfy the equation or not see our equation is this we will check this equation x is equal to what minus 5 y is equal to what 3 and z is equal to what 4 so this is minus 2 and it is minus 8 which gives minus 10 so it is satisfied further remaining these three equations also you can verify so this is our answer so the correct answer is this x is equal to x is equal to minus 5 y is equal to 3 and z is equal to 4 now let us continue with the another question we will continue with the another question
question number 3 so the question is x plus z equals to 1 yes students x plus z is equals to 1 then next equation is y plus z is equals to 1 y plus z equals to 1 and the next equation is x plus y is equal to 4 ok ye bohat asan hoga question x plus z is 1 y plus z is 1 and x plus y is 4 so let us do this d that is determinant of the coefficients of x y z 1 yaha koi y term nahi iska matlab 0 hai iska coefficient uh, y x term nahi hai yaha pe so iska coefficient 0 hoga hai x 1 y aur z nahi hai so 0 so expand this determinant iska expansion karenge aap 1 into 0 minus 1 okay good minus 0 plus 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 1 into ok 0 minus 1 and this gives us minus 1 or a minus 1 minus 2 i bar so d is equal to how much minus 2 so we are getting d is equal to how much minus 2 yes students so or d is equal to what minus 2 yes next is dx find karna hai so dx is equal to what so dx is equal to what see here dx is what uh, we replace coefficients of x by constants the constant is 1 1 4 ye constant 1 1 4 0 1 1 1 1 0 expand this so expansion of this is what 1 into 0 minus 1 that is minus 1 period 0 i got with last term 1 1 into 1 minus 4 that is minus 3 which gives us minus 4 ok minus 3 and this minus 1 then dy what is dy ok students dy so dy is obtained from d by replacing the coefficients of y by constants 1 1 4 are the constants ok students then uh, 1 1 0 expand this what will be the expansion 1 into 0 minus 4 then minus 1 into so 0 minus 1 minus 1 plus 1 into 0 minus 1 what is the expansion this is minus 4 here plus 1 and minus 1 this is getting cancelled minus 4 we are getting dy so we are getting dy is equal to what see here dx is minus 4 dy be up to minus 4 we are we will check it then dz so we will find dz so what is dz dz is obtained from d by replacing the coefficients of z by constants what are the constants 1 1 4 expand this what will be the expansion 1 into 4 minus 1 that is 3 minus 0 and then plus 1 1 into 0 minus 1 that is minus 1 which is equal to 2 yes 2 we are getting 2 so dz is equal to what 2 we are getting dz equals to what 2 so thus we are getting d is equal to what listen here we are getting d is equal to what so d is equal to minus 2 dx what is dx dx can be where minus 4 dy is what yes dy is what minus 4 and dz is equal to what dz is equal to 2 so now let us find x y and z 
तो ये स्टूडेंट्स x y एंड z वी विल फाइंड नाउ x y एंड z विल फाइंड नाउ x y z तो x इज इक्वल टू आर डी एक्स अपॉन डी वट इज डी एंड वट इज सी डी एक्स इज वॉट डी एक्स क्या है माइनस फोर है डी है माइनस टू इट इज इक्वल टू टू फिर वाई वाई इज इक्वल टू आर डी वाई अपॉन डी डी वाई अपॉन डी वट इज और डी वाई डी वाई भी माइनस फोर ही है एंड ये माइनस टू तो इट इज टू तो डी जेड क्या है बेटा डी जेड सी आर डी जेड अपॉन डी दैट इज जेड So what is this minus? So D Z is two and this is what minus two is minus one. So you are getting x is equal to what? Two y is equal to two or Z is equal to minus one. Let us check this equation satisfies the values of x y z or not. So अगर x is equal to यहाँ पे टू रखते ये z इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन क्लियरली टू जस वन y इज इक्वल टू 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 लिखते और z इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन तो क्लियरली इट इज वन x इज टू और y इज टू लिखते तो फोर मिलेगा आपको यस दिस इज द राइट आंसर ओके देन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी विल डू सो नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी विल डू students we'll do the next one here see the question is this minus 2 here minus 2 upon x then minus of 1 upon y माइनस ऑफ थ्री अपॉन से इज इक्वल टू थ्री नेक्स्ट इक्वेशन इज टू बाय एक्स माइनस थ्री बाय वाई वन अपॉन सेट इट इज इक्वल टू आर माइनस थर्टी एंड द लास्ट इक्वेशन इज टू बाय एक्स टू बाय एक्स माइनस थ्री बाय जेड विच इज इक्वल टू माइनस इलेवन ये स्टूडेंट्स सो हियर टू बाय एक्स माइनस वन अपॉन वाई माइनस थ्री अपॉन जेड इक्व टू थ्री टू बाय एक्स माइनस थ्री बाय वाई वन अपॉन जेड इज माइनस थर्टीन टू बाय एक्स माइनस थ्री बाय जेड इक्व टू माइनस इलेवन नाउ सी दिस वन अपॉन एक्स ये स्टूडेंट्स दिस वन अपॉन एक्स वी विल राइट एज कैपिटल एक्स वन अपॉन वाई वी विल राइट एज कैपिटल वाई वन अपॉन जेड वी विल राइट एज कैपिटल जेड तो इक्वेशन विल टेक्स द अनदर फॉर्म अनदर फॉर्म मीन्स माइनस टू एक्स माइनस वाई माइनस थ्री जेड दिस इज फॉर आवर कंटिन्यूस वी आर डूइंग थ्री फिर 2x एक्स माइनस थ्री वाई प्लस जेड इज इक्वल टू माइनस थर्टी और लास्ट इक्वेशन क्या होगा 2x एक्स माइनस थ्री वाई नो देर इज नो वाई टर्म माइनस वॉट थ्री जेड इज इक्वल टू माइनस इलेवन सो वी विल सॉल्व दिस इक्वेशन so first of all we will find what d so yes students d is equal to r it is determinant of the coefficients of capital x y z minus 2 minus 1 minus 3 2 minus 3 1 and 2 0 minus 3 expand it this determinant we will expand so what is the expansion minus 2 into 9 minus 0 is 
yes then minus of minus 1 will be plus 1 into plus 1 into minus 6 minus 2 minus 8 minus 3 into 0 plus 6 it will be how much it will be minus 18 this is minus 8 and again it is 18 minus 18 ok so this will be Forty four is yes, thirty six, and this is what minus thirty six, and this is what minus eight. So, yes, it is minus forty four. So, minus forty four it is. So, this is what minus forty four, what D it is. So, D is equal to this then uh, we find dx so dx we will find so find dx so in dx what we do see the coefficient of x capital x this is what capital x so coefficient of capital x we replace by constants so what are the constants 3 minus 13 क्या क्या कांस्टेंट से देखो 3 minus 13 and minus 11 are constant बाकी के दो कॉलम as it is लिखना है आपको 0 minus 3 1 और minus 3 ये कॉलम as it is लिखने है here dx is equal to what then expansion of this determinant 3 into 9 minus of minus 1 that is plus 1 39 plus 11 plus 11 then minus 3 into 0 minus 33 ok it is 0 minus 33 so which is 27 27 और ये हुआ 50 और this is plus plus what 99 okay so So 176. Then this is plus 176 dx. dx is equal to what? 176 you are getting dx. Then <coughs> then dy we will find. Yes, students. dy. So how to get dy? Listen, dy is obtained from d by replacing the coefficients of y by constants. So it is minus 2, 2, 2. Coefficients of y we replace by constants that is 3 minus 13 or minus 11. Ye constant say, dekho, ye 3. <coughs> 3 minus 13 or minus 11 are the constants. Haan. Now, uh, third column as it is written up to minus 3, 1 or minus 3. We will expand this determinant. So, this will expand. Karo. So, what will be the expansion of this? It is minus 2 into 39 plus 11 minus 3 into minus 6 minus 2 minus 3 into minus 3 into minus 22 plus 
It is how much it is four, so it will be minus twelve, which is minus hundred plus twelve, which is eighty-eight. Okay, it is minus eighty-eight. Dy is minus eighty-eight. See here, dy. Is equal to minus eighty-eight. Yes, students. Then T Z we will find how to get T Z. Yes, pay attention. T Z it is equal to determinant. Determinant what? T Z is determinant of what? Minus two two uh, minus two two and two. First column. Then second column is minus one, minus three, zero. And the third column means what? Coefficient of z we replace by constant. That is three minus thirteen and minus eleven. What will be the expansion? Minus two into thirty-three, thirty-three plus one into minus twenty-two. Plus twenty six plus twenty six minus twenty two plus twenty six and three into zero plus six eighty rupees. So what will be this? Sixty six minus sixty six and this is what four plus four and this is eighteen. Eighteen. So d z is equal to what? D z is equal to uh, minus sixty six, and this is minus sixty six plus twenty two, which is minus forty four. Minus forty four. So d z is equal to what? Minus forty four. Yes, students. Dx mila hai, dy mila hai, dz mila hai. Ye bhi multiple of forty four hai. Okay. So, what is this? So once again, we will write it. D, dx, dy, dz. Sab apko likhna hai yahan pe. Okay. So here. D is equal to what? D is equal to minus forty four. D X. What is D X? One seventy six. D Y. What is D Y? Is what? D Y is. D Y is minus eighty eight. Minus eighty eight. Minus eighty eight. D is equal to minus forty four. D Y is this. D Z is equal to what? D Z is equal to minus forty four. So therefore, X is equal to what? D X upon D, which is what is D X? D X is one seventy six. Divided by minus forty four, so which is minus four, minus four. If we cancel this, we will be getting it minus four. 
then this is what x then y is what what is y y is capital y dy upon d which is minus 88 upon minus 44 and it is 2 plus 2 is z so what is z z is dz upon d what is dz dz is minus 44 what is d d is again minus 44 which is 1 so yes students we are getting here we are getting x y z x is equal to what we are getting x is equal to capital x is equal to capital x is equal to minus 4 capital y is equal to 2 and capital z is equal to what 1 so this we are getting so let us check these values are satisfied by this equation or not ye equation se satisfy hota hai ki nahi wo dekhna hai here uh, x is minus 2 uh, minus 4 so this gives us plus 8 y is 2 so minus 2 over and z is what 1 so ye hoga 6 6 or minus 3 z is 1 so minus 3 that is equal to 3 you are getting this so it means it satisfies the equation so therefore but we are interested to find small x y z up deko substitution is this ये temporary हमने substitute किया है capital X capital Y and capital Z so therefore our required answer is what capital X क्या है minus 4 so small x will be equal to minus 1 upon 4 capital Y is equal to what capital Y is equal to 2 है so small y is equal to reciprocal of that 1 upon 2 और capital Z 1 है तो Z will make no difference small Z is also equal to 1 so this is actually this is our answer so the required answer is this ये आपका required answer है small x is minus 1 upon 4 y is 1 upon 2 Z is 1 Okay, this is the answer. Then we will do the next question. Here, let us do the next question. sum of see the equation is this the sum of three numbers is 15 yes students sum of three numbers is 15 Matlab x plus y plus z that is equal to what 15 Fir uske baad kya hai? if the second number is subtracted Matlab second number y y subtract karna hai. subtract it from the sum of first and third number sum of first or third number usme se second number subtract karna so if second number is subtracted from the sum of first and third number we get 5 aapko 5 milega then when the third number is subtracted from sum of twice first number and the second number we get 4 so the last equation we will be getting twice first number 2x 
sum of sum of twice the first number and the second number ये second number इसमें से क्या subtract करना है when the third number is subtracted मतलब z is subtracted what you will get four you will get four तो ये हमको क्रेमर्स रूल से सॉल्व करना है वट इज और डी डी इज इक्वल टू डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ द कोफिशेंट्स ऑफ एक्स वन 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 माइनस वन वन फिर वन टू वन माइनस वन एक्सपेंशन ऑफ दिस वन इन टू ये माइनस वन और ये माइनस ये वन और ये माइनस वन जीरो आएगा माइनस वन इन टू ये वन से लिखते हैं दिस वन राइट इट वन ओवर हेयर लाइक दिस सेम कॉलम देन माइनस वन इन टू माइनस वन माइनस टू दैट इज माइनस थ्री प्लस वन इन टू वन प्लस टू दैट इज थ्री हाँ सो दिस इज वॉट प्लस थ्री आएगा ये भी प्लस थ्री दिस गिव्स अ सिक्स वी आर गेटिंग डी इज इक्वल टू ऑट सिक्स सो डी इज इक्वल टू ऑट सिक्स यू आर गेटिंग देन वी फाइंड डी एक्स फाइंड डी एक्स तो डी एक्स इज ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम डी बाय रिप्लेसिंग द कोशंस ऑफ एक्स बाय कॉन्स्टेंट फिफ्टीन इज कॉन्स्टेंट द नेक्स्ट कॉन्स्टेंट इज फाइव एंड द नेक्स्ट कॉन्स्टेंट इज फोर सेकेंड कॉलम एज बी वन माइनस वन 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 माइनस वन एक्सपेंड इट फिफ्टीन इन टू वन माइनस वन जीरो माइनस वन इन टू माइनस फाइव माइनस फोर माइनस नाइन ओके माइनस वन इंटू माइनस फाइव माइनस फोर माइनस नाइन प्लस वन इन टू फाइव प्लस फोर नाइन विच इज एटीन सो विच इज वॉट एटीन सो विच इज इक्वल टू वॉट एटीन Yes, dx is equal to 18. Then we find dy. So dy is equal to what? 1, 1, 2, 1, 1, 2. Here y coefficients of y we replace by constant 5, 15, 5 and 4. Here 1, 1 minus 1. Expand this. So one into determinant of this minus five minus four minus nine it is minus fifteen into here minus one minus two minus three plus one into four minus ten minus six. So the expansion is what minus nine forty five forty five is. Minus six, so which is thirty. Okay, this is what fifteen minus fifteen. Okay, subtract thirty. Then this is what dy. So we are getting dx is equal to here we will write dx is equal to eighteen. Dy is equal to thirty. Now the Last one is what to find d z. So we have to find now d z. So we'll find what d z. D z we will find. D z is equal to. dz is equal to see one one two one minus one one and this we replace by constants 
that is we replace by constants. So, what are the constants? 15, 5, and 4 are the constants. So, expand this determinant 1 into minus 4 minus 5 is minus 9 minus 1 into expansion 4 minus 10 minus 6 and 15 into 1 plus 2 that is 3 so it is this is minus 9 and this plus 6 minus 3 minus 9 and this is plus 6 minus 3 plus 45 this will, it will give us 42, 42. So, we are getting d z is equal to what? 42. d z is equal to 42. Thus, so we are getting here d is equal to 6, d x is equal to what? dx is equal to 18, dy is equal to what? 30 and dz is equal to what? 42. 42. So, therefore, x is equal to what? x is dx upon d which is 18 upon 6 matlab 3, 18 upon 6 that is 3. So, we are getting x is equal to what 3, uh, y is equal to what, y is equal to dy upon d, what is dy, 30 upon 6 is equal to 5, so we are be getting y is equal to what 5, then dz, z is equal to what, dz upon d what is dz dz is 42 upon 6 so it is 7 that means we are getting here x is equal to 3 y is equal to 5 and z is equal to what 7 so let us check these values are satisfied by the equation or not ye hamare equation hai x is equal to 3 likhte y is equal to 5 8 ho 8 plus 7 15 so they are correct answer so that means the required numbers are 3 the 3 numbers are what x is 3 y is 5 and z is 7 so here this problem is completed the exercise is completed thank you for watching this video and we will stop over here so thanks for watching this video